for me, the team element is so important. I'm very much a team player and I think it's so cool when you are able to recognize your own strengths but also your own weaknesses and also see that in other people because people are so talented and they're so good in so many things. And I think growing up playing team sports always, you get to really appreciate that and really leverage each other's strengths. So I think that's definitely one very important one. Dudes, especially in the States, um, I would you know, practice four hours a day and like travel during the weekend and to have games and stuff. So you don't really have a lot of time to do a whole lot of things. And you just make it work. You're just like, whatever, like I don't have a whole lot of time, but I'm just gonna sit down, I'm gonna make it work. Um, so that work hard, play hard attitude is definitely something I take into my, um, into my daily life personal life, um, but also work-wise a lot. I'm Frederique, my name is Frederique Haverhals. I'm from the Netherlands and I'm studying a master in finance here at IE. And previously I did my bachelor's in Boston actually, um, also finance and marketing as well. And uh, worked in New York for a year, came back during COVID to Amsterdam, which is where I'm from. And uh, yeah, now I'm in Madrid and I'm loving it. I think the next best me is like a better version of myself. Um, I think if you say truly like your authentic self and just keep developing your skills and who you are and keep meeting new people, that is when you sort of become your new best version of yourself. And I think you just kind of find pieces along the way that, you know, sort of form your next best you. It can be very fulfilling in a way because, I mean, personally, like I love learning new stuff. I love meeting new people. And I think it's so enriching and fulfilling when you do actually meet those new people and surround yourself in new environments. Like for me, myself, I took a leap of faith when I was 18 years old, went to the US and uh, to study there and kind of had to figure it all out by myself. But then did it again when I started working in New York and had to do it again when I went to Amsterdam and again here in Madrid. And it's been very cool because you get to to meet so many different people along the way and you get to learn so many lessons about yourself and that just allows you to grow as a person. So I think it's just a very fulfilling thing to do. It also really put a mirror in front of me that I couldn't get around. Um, so I think COVID in that sense definitely had some benefits for it too, to, for me to understand what do I want to do with my life? Where do I want to be? What are the things that I really appreciate in life? And what are the things that are not really my thing? Just, you know, despite it being very hard, just embrace it and just take it and just go for it.